Hey! So it's Sunday and it is my husband's birthday. So we are going to make a cake for him. It's a key lime cake. Look, I got little boys with me. Look, there's the other one back there. So we're going to, okay, I'm sorry, big, <laughs> strong, strapping what? young men. Okay. Is that better? I'm 14. Okay, that was appropriate for 14. I have young men with me. And we're going to make this recipe. It's really cool. I'll leave the recipe in the description because it really is quite yummy. So I'll just pop in and out as we're making it. Okay, we have the oven set to 325. All right, that's great. <laughs> Here's some of what we're going to use. Lemon cake. Lime jello. This gives it color. Awesome. Key lime juice. Got to have key lime juice. Butter. butter. Got to have butter. All right. We need orange juice oh. and a little oil. Oh, excuse me. So we're going to start mixing all of our fun stuff. Oh, and we need eggs. Can you go grab the eggs, buddy? Oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-huh, are you mixing with that? Okay. We need five eggs. No. Let's see. Hey, don't smash That's a third. All right, I got the eggs. All right, so we need. There we go. Are these the eggs? That's the eggs. We need three fourths of a cup of orange juice. Oh my gosh. You hold this, buddy. Hold that. All right, here we go. I'm trying my best not to crack the eggs. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah, we want to crack them, just we want to crack them inside. The holy cow, we had just enough. <laughs> okay. We need the same amount of oil. This is why it tastes so yummy. <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh, wow, okay. One three ounce package of Jell-O. You just need one. So what this does is this gives it the color, the green color. And it gives a little bit of lime taste as well. Let's crack our eggs. You ready? Yeah. You wanna How try? do we do them? How do we do them? You're okay, just... you just pop it on the side, make a little hole. Okay. And then you just pull it open and let it come out. Okay. You wanna try it in a separate bowl or you wanna try it on here? I'll try it on here. So you wanna just... try it? No. Yeah, just get a little hole. Oh, okay, now, yep, and try not to get any shell inside yeah. the bowl, okay? Good job, you did it. Oh, jeez. It's okay. I got it. You got it. We don't need perfection. That was close. Ah. Uh, I know, you're gonna have to wash your hands. Okay. We're gonna put Cake mixer. Then we gotta put a little bit of lime juice and Carson's favorite. What's your favorite? Powdered sugar. Yes. <laughs> Carson would really like to taste it as it is being entered, right? in the mixer but I will kind of just mix a little start us off yeah this one mm-hmm hey. I just do this so it won't splash yeah all right so we're gonna do a fourth of a cup of lime juice and we have to use the key lime 
to throw this away. It's better. Okay, thank you, buddy. Well, if I can get it, are you moving the camera around? <laughs> okay. Here we go. This is what gives it the good flavor. Mmm, look at that. Okay. Now, now what we're going to do is we're going to add some powdered sugar. And we're going to get it mixed. All right. Let's switch places. And we will get our powdered sugar out. I think we already have some, actually. Yes. Okay, so I gotta get in here. Wow. <laughs> All right, so we need four or five teaspoons of the powdered sugar. It seems a little bit excessive, but trust me, this recipe needs it. You need a little sweet to sort out that tart. Right? Okay, so once it's mixed pretty well, we'll step it up a little. Make sure we get all of the little pockets out of it. I always want to check the bottom, make sure it doesn't have a thing in it. It does not. You see how pretty the color is? Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at that creation y'all just made. Look at that. Gorgeousness. Okay, it looks good. You want to try some? Just use a little Pam. Mm -hmm. I get it all on the sides. And I'll show you my little trick. Okay. I mean, you want to get it coated. There we go. Take a little flour, 
you sprinkle a little flour in it. You might have to use a little bit more, okay? And then you start spreading it around the pan. Okay. We're gonna spread it all the way around the pan and the sides. It works a little better if you do it kind of immediately. So let's put it over on this side. You can get out any of the rest. <laughs> There's Papa. So you just kind of spread it around. Cake's important. The most important is to get it on the bottom. Once that one's ready. Hey Papa. You doing okay? Mm-hmm. We are making a okay. cake. Yeah, John's key lime cake. Key lime, good mm -hmm. cake. Very good cake. <laughs> I know. All right. All right, these are ready. He's making a picture of the cake. <laughs> yeah. in here <laughs> whenever there is food around there are dogs okay now we will just divide it into the two pans hold on let me get in here all righty i know i see you baby and then we'll make the icing while the cakes are cooking For the icing, you'll need cream cheese, eight ounces softened, and four tablespoons of matzo softened. Okay. <laughs> I try to get them about as even as I can. It's better if you have layers, because then you get to put icing in between them. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yes. All right, I think our oven is ready. Yep. All right, so I'll just put them in here. Okay, and we'll set 38 minutes. Okay, you can hit stop. Okay, I think I lost my helper because he's playing with the science experiments. Still? <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> so, I'm switching over to my other helper. Hold the camera. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna do the icing. So we need eight ounces of cream cheese, softened. You want it to be softened. This is nice and softened. It's sat out and gotten room temperature. So cream cheese. And then four tablespoons of butter. All right. And we need a lot of sugar. It's pan down on the floor. Look at the mess on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> That's nothing. You should see the best on the cabinet. Holy cow. Okay. We'll see. I think it just smells need... like butter in here. Does it smell like butter? Yeah. That's funny. Alright, so I'm going to take these two. 
Put it in my mixer. Here. I'm gonna cream these together. I'm sure that was a close-up shot. Close All right, so we shot. need one teaspoon of vanilla. <clears throat> Hello, Bella. How are okay. you doing? Hi, Bella. Need a, that's a tablespoon. A tablespoon. A tablespoon. A tablespoon. And I got this when I was in Mexico. This stuff is awesome. It smells so good. It smells Oh my gosh, it actually smells right. like, it smells like uh, alcohol. You put like a tablespoon <laughs> in the spoon and... It's Mexican it. vanilla. Smell. Okay, that's vanilla. Oh yeah, gosh, it's, <laughs> it's strong, right? Yeah, it's... Uh, okay. Whew. So now, mm. what I'll do is... I'm going to start putting in powdered sugar. It takes about a half a package. So if you have a package like this, this is what, 32 ounces? It would take about a third of that. See how pretty it's getting when looking there? Yum. Y'all, this is the best part. So what is this container? Is this 16? And that's powdered sugar. Yeah, I know it's powdered sugar. I was trying to figure out what size it is. Cut it down so we don't spill everywhere. Just about this whole container, not quite. Or maybe the whole thing. Yeah. This is what? This is a pound, I think, so that's what I need. Mean. This is the part you'll want to try. Me? Mmm. Me? Mm hmm. It's got powdered sugar in it. <laughs> no, he isn't. <laughs> I approve of this. Uh-huh, that's what I thought. <laughs> it needs a little bit more powdered sugar. Yeah, I think it does. So you just taste it. If you can still taste, ah. it would be better if I was not making a mess because I have this open. All right, here we go. If you can still really taste the butter and the cream cheese, you need a little bit more. Okay. All right, we'll be back when the cakes are done. Okay, you can hit how well the bottom came out. Very little stuck to the pan. This one came out perfect as well. Hi, Sassy, are you ready for cake? You are. <gasps> Who else is ready for cake? Bella? Bella's ready for cake? <gasps> Boys are ready for cake? The boys are ready for cake. Oh, Papa's ready for cake. Papa wants cake. Cake. Grandma's coming. <laughs> Grandma wants cake. Grandma wants cake. I want cake. Where's John? He's coming. He went to get on his stretchy pants. Stretchy pants. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Yes, because he's had so. Hard, 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 hard. There's John's piece of cake. Takes up <laughs> the whole plate. <laughs> 